Hey guys, tonight I'm bringing y'all a project update and a how-to video, actually. And uh, here you see two ARLX cabooses. This one is actually going to be used on the Mo train, and this is actually going to a friend of mine. This is a X Santa Fe caboose, and this is a X Union Pacific caboose. Uh, so this is going to my friend, and this is I'm gonna keep or sell. So basically tonight what I'm doing is I'm cashing these out to ARLX for a friend of mine. And I read online that if you take a pencil eraser to the uh, reporting marks or decals on this on an Athern Blue Box unit, it will come off. So uh, I'm going to try it tonight and uh, so let's see how this goes. I'm not sure if it'll uh, come off or not. I need to set these somewhere so they don't roll off. Okay. Doesn't seem like they're wanting to come off that easy. They're starting to fade just a little bit. Okay guys, it seems like it's gonna take somewhat some hassle to get some of these off, so I will get back with you when they decide to want to come off more easier okay I'm back so uh, I read that uh, this actually will not work very good so um, what you need is some rubbing alcohol and uh, a q-tip and what you do is you just take just a look just dip your uh, q-tip into your alcohol and gently go over what you want to take off and then very quickly take a brush and it should start coming off and this is going to be actually just a leasing engine so it's okay if you start seeing the prom paint because that's actually what we want to see with a leasing unit Should actually start coming off in a minute. Yeah, the decals are starting to fade actually. Sorry, let me shut my door, please. Okay, sorry about that. Let's get back to this. This is actually starting to fade down a little bit. Okay, I'll get back with you guys in just a minute. Okay, so I finally am done with stripping the decals. And basically, what I'm going to be doing is adding a number right here, right here, and right here on both sides will be black ARLX along with black numbers. So, there's that unit. And I also faded the gray down a little bit, as y'all can see. So, and um, also, this unit did not cooperate with me. Um, I'm going to put the numbers here just like normal. But I'm actually going to leave that there. And I'm going to put one single ARLX decal across the uh, front nose here. So, that's about it until on decal-wise. Until I get decals in, I will make another update video on this. And a rail fanning video is coming tomorrow. I'll catch you guys later.